blockhead! <laughs> Ah! Hey man, are you thirsty? Oh, he does throw it. I hate everything. I think we still got enough money. I really like, I hate this game. <laughs> no, we don't. Ah, that's annoying. How much do we need? I need like 30,000, I think. I really Let's... didn't want to do another job. Just, I was hoping I could have completed that so we could have just gone and do the ranked assassin mission, but that's fine. Uh. It's okay. We'll just go collect some more kitties. They're actually just like really random. Like they honestly had no consistency in when they would attack and when they would just like wait for you. It was honestly well, and that's hard to predict their like patterns. <laughs> yeah, and that's the problem with like those missions because again, it's it's a one hit you lose. So if like there's nothing to like, so if you can't like learn the patterns of the bad guys, then it's all just luck. You know, and it's almost like the, there was like a, a few moments there where I was just we both were just waning, and it's like, well, what are we doing here? Like, I have I have a time limit; they don't. So it's like, do I just try to hit them so I can get the kill, or do I try to hit them and then get hit? And then it's like, yeah, um, there we go. Let's see if he gives us any wise words for giving him the last seven balls. No, he just beats the crap out of you. You got that? The technique is yours and yours alone. The final ball! I've played my part. Travis, you're now looking at yourself. What you see in the mirror, that is what awaits you. It's your fate. Make of it what you wish. Continue down the path of murder, and this is what awaits. But hell, don't get me wrong. This isn't all bad. Nothing awaits you beyond the limits of killing. There's no scenery from the peak. No pot of gold. No nirvana. But that's not to say that the scenery is so awful. If that's what you wish to gaze upon, then by all means continue your death march. No hesitation. Kill, kill, kill. I played my part. Travis, be the best. Alright, I guess he gave us some encouraging murder. Speak, sure. Thanks. You know, the first half of that was actually like, I'm like, you know what, I would love, I would love to read this in a Chinese fortune cookie. And then, that was <laughs> and it. Then, that's and all we got. got. Great. Got a pat on the back. I mean, the upgrades you are can do this. more important than, yeah. Good more job, buddy. Is, thanks for collecting more. these. I, now I can go back to drinking. Yeah. Hey, man, thanks for the, like, the 100 giant dodgeball things you gave me. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, I'm just going to keep them here in the corner. I don't know why I need all these, but... <laughs> I just imagine I like, the like, bartender, like, just sees in the corner of that little Japanese bar, like, yeah, 70 or 80 of those rubber balls. Like, what is all that? Why is that here? Yeah. I, and like, the, sir, are you are you ever gonna take these home? You don't live. Like, well, I was gonna say is, then the bar, bar then the bartender realizes that he's their only customer, and they're like, "Well, I mean, we can't even really tell him to leave. He's our only business. He stays here all day. All the batting ones, I have no rank on. Sad. Pizza butt, love it. Uh." I almost want to try one of those again too. Let's let's give it another go. And if I can't complete this one, I'll just do one of the uh, the timed like killing missions around the area, because there were some up there that aren't as difficult as the one I unlocked. So I was trying to look up and see what a Lavakov ball was. And apparently it's like I, I I didn't see any like indication of it. Oh, these are inspired by actual like dodgeballs or whatever they are supposed to be. Sure. It says, right. oh yeah, they're just a tw they're just an item from the 2007 game Numer Heroes. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the vague description. That is that's a great point. Like yeah, what is the point of them other than just things to collect that give you like upgrades? Yeah, like they're clearly inspired by something. It said that they're red balls with like little yellow inscriptions. So there, there's like there, and there, I think there were like little like things written on them. I just assumed they're like little Japanese, like uh, like symbols or Japanese characters, <clears throat> which probably like meant something. I don't know. It meant it meant peace. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's, it, the game didn't like indicate. Oh yeah, these were inspired by uh, or Suda Fifty One says yeah, these are these are inspired by actual like Russian dodgeballs or oh, I keep calling them dodgeballs. I don't know what the hell they are. <laughs> I don't know.
Batter up. Oh my god. Why can I never get more than one? I did it. Yay. Why are those missions just not for me? I don't I don't get it. It has to be because I'm using the just the controller. I don't know what else it could be. Corey, how was baseball practice today? Oh, I hate it, Mom. I hate it. <laughs> well, I mean, we did get enough from doing that, and we'll have exactly $9 left. <laughs> Which is not enough for anything in this world. Because <laughs> everything here... T-shirts cost $12,000. Like, I don't... I'll take it. That's fine. We got enough to do the mission. Whatever. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, wait. And this is uh, rank number three. Oh, this is the big... Uh, the witch, or whatever that they called her. Yep. I was like so d disappointed by the boss fight. It it's cool because it's different, but like I remember, like, oh, you're gonna go for the witch. Like, I gotta see what this is like, and it's like, eh, it's not what I expected. It's not really a boss fight so much as it's like one of those puzzle bosses. Yeah, you know? yeah. I think we talked we talked about that before, which I'm okay with. I, I like it when the bosses change it up like that. I just feel like I, I guess it, it was just not what, what I, I was expecting when you hear that the boss is a witch. Like, I, I guess I was expecting like you wanted a more some magical. Elements. I was ex expecting like like magic and hexes or something like that, but it turns out to just be like yeah, it was, it was just very uh, yeah, didn't meet my expectations. Run, Travis, run! Forget that motorcycle. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit! They've eaten all those burgers from Burger Mart. Oh my God! She's doing yoga. Of course she is. That is not even like a yoga outfit, like we fit trainer who. A <laughs> witch. And now we found the inspiration of we fit trainer. Yeah, Shigeru Miyamoto played No More Heroes when it came out, and he was like, "Huh, I really am into yoga now." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. And now you can find those boards a dime a dozen at every Goodwill or thrift store. They were a neat concept. I just, I, I actually, think they were like, "What well, working out?" I don't, I don't want to play. I don't want to work out to play video games. Oh, I like how those masks. They end up getting some of them in your bathroom as you collect a lot of them. Man, I'm starting, starting to run out of room for these masks. I just put them in the bathroom. Yeah, all these nerdy collectibles. Can you imagine like going into someone's bathroom and it's just like a shelf full of like action figures. Like it'd be cool, but I'd be like, like why? <laughs> why did you put them in here? No, Gene! Don't come out! No, Gene! Gene, why are you leaving? No! Travis, don't let the cat out! He won't come back. Or she. Whatever. Oh, Gene. Maybe never, he should be in that mission. I never actually noticed cat. that. Yeah, I think Gene actually might be in this in this mission. No More Heroes is a wacky game. In uh, the newest one, Travis Strikes Back, Gene actually like just talks to you, even though she's a cat. <laughs> Hi, Travis. And then apparently in No More Heroes 3, like, Travis has, like, two kids, and I'm like, what? What? When did that happen? <laughs> Travis also has a brother. You should look up the name of Travis's brother. It's pretty hilarious. Like, the... I think it's something cool down, because Travis is, like, Travis Touchdown. Like, it's a great name or something. <laughs> Kevin Cooldown. It's... It's... I, I can't remember it, but it's hilarious. Steven Slapshot. <laughs> it has to be like a sports thing, you know? Wow, she's just coming out with the hard F-bomb right away. Yeah. Speed Buster, that was her name. Yeah, I just don't know what... Anyway. I'll fight some bus thugs. Oh, no. Is it B to dodge? What's the... Oh, no. You just have to dodge. Like, okay. I love their, like, purple suits. They remind me of, like, Yakuza members or something. The Yakuza. Oh, hey, a chest. They're not even trying with the secrets now. They just put the chest with the trading card right there. Like, yeah, we're getting to the end of the game. You just want to fight. 
Is it just me or like the last couple like boss fights? Like the path to get to the boss is I I just don't feel they're very ambitious. It's like yeah, here fight a couple guys and then go for the boss. Like before yeah. it was actually like here. Like I remember like either the, the very first one like we go to the baseball stadium to fight like Doctor Peace. Like it's a it's a fairly like long level, you know. And then the other ones are just like oh fight fight a couple guys in the subway. That's, that's what you gotta do. I I definitely agree with you. It seemed to, it seems like a little front loaded replaying <laughs> this game again. Yeah. Like they kind of get your they get they get your hopes your your hopes up like oh wow I hope every boss is as detailed as this like you know and some of them are just like yeah just just go fight the boss who cares I guess it kind of just picks it I guess it just picks the pace up to be like here let's try to finish this game and you know there's one know. of those random Middle Eastern heads that are literally just there like there's no purpose for them we looked that up too in one of the let's plays I think. Couldn't we have just got on the bus to begin with? Like, why do we have to fight the guys, necessarily? Because video game logic. The door to the bus won't open unless you defeat all the enemies. Wait a minute, was there someone driving the bus? Oh yeah, there is. Because I was gonna say, there's <laughs> no one else on the bus besides Travis. Oh wow, no one else is on the highway, too. You, ne you wouldn't think the highway near a big city would be just completely empty. I-95, this is not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, he's hiding in the, the upper storage compartment. Oh, this is kind of cool. I like how it's like a different angle. It's almost like a side scroller or like a Smash Brothers. Oh, poor yeah. one out that Travis didn't make it in Smash. I mean, he's kind of there, but not as a playable character. He should be. I would have like, loved that. You know, the bus driver must be like shit in, shit in his pants. <laughs> I gotta get this guy behind me. This is actually kind of difficult just because this one dude right here. There we go. Sorry. Travis. Sorry, bus driver. Now you're covered in blood. <laughs> Travis is just like, just keep driving! <laughs> I was like, oh, please, I don't want to die. <laughs> if I die, we all die. <laughs> oh, thank God. I'm Super Saiyan now. Come on, spawn them. This always happens. I always get the power-up. Luckily, I have the long power-up. Look at that tiger just mosey on by. Where are these people just hiding like, in the storage compartments? They are, yeah! Oh! Oh! WHERE IS HE HIDING?! WHAT?! <laughs> also, I lost my Super Saiyan! God. No. Oh. I think I got, like, the perfect dodge there. I got the flurry attack, because I'm trying to okay. dodge. I'm kind of just mashing a little bit, too, because it's a little chaotic. Oh, wow, I actually lost the, uh, the clang. Or the clash. That never happened. I've never seen that. Bus driver definitely don't look back now. Charging the beam katana. <laughs> Mr. Bus driver, don't look at me. Oh, that was the undodgeable or unblockable. It's kind of hard to like actually avoid that with the tight space. There we go. Oh man, I'm worried about the. Oh wow, we're ready here. Do I have to save on the disgusting bus bathroom? <laughs> oh man, Mike, uh, have you I ever had to that. use one of those bathrooms in a bus? Oh, sadly I have. And not just for number one. Oh, you did number two? Oh, wow. When you gotta go, you gotta go. I, I, I don't think they're that bad compared to, like, a porta potty That's fair. I've definitely used them as well, and, yeah, they could be... You'd, it, it, I question why, like, this one's a little bit nicer, because at least it's, like, a completely flat wall, but most of them have, like, seats right next to it, and it's like, who wants to sit right next to the bathroom? You're just going to get oat or wafts of that the whole trip. Yeah. You'd think they'd almost put, like, some like something else back there. Maybe a little, <laughs> little like, vending machine or a, who knows what. To be fair, why don't have buses? Why do buses not have vending machines? That'd be a really good idea. Because you know there are some people on there who's like, man, I can go for some M&Ms right now. As I'm on my way to the grocery store on the bus. Do you think this bus driver is going to make me have to pay for this broken window? I mean, that was the Husa members. That wasn't really me. Yeah. Um, sir, could you, I'm I'm going to have to bill you for all the blood on the seats. It's going to take it's going to take a lot of money to you know get all that blood out. And the body parts everywhere. 
We'll send you a bill. I do remember like this area being kind of cool, and it kind of made me wish there was like like this is where like the actual like boss level took place, as opposed to like on a bus. Because it's like a desolate city, you know. It is very unique. Travis is like, wait, where am I stopping? Is this a uh, Raccoon City? Yeah. <laughs> No. <laughs> that stupid reaction of Travis being like, uh, whoa. He's, he's probably like, how'd you get here, Gene? Did you sneak on that bus too? Speed City, that's what it's called. Yeah, but literally, look, most of the level is just this boss fight. Because yeah. they put everything right here in front of us. Oh, good. Speaking of porta bodies, there we go. I mean, honestly, looking at this city, maybe I would have used the bathroom on the bus compared yeah. to this porta potty. I'm probably better off just going in the alleyway, going in behind the porta potty. <laughs> now it is a grasshopper manufactured porta potty, so that must be nice. Maybe it has like a little demo of a game in there to play while you do your business. No, that's truly living in the future. I like how it still makes the flushing noise. <laughs> and these porta potties are really coming along. They've come a long way. Here we go against Mrs. Speedbuster. Speedy Witchbuster. Oh! I didn't realize this guy is in it. Oh, yes. Whoa! What? That beam katana is super cool, and I don't remember that. I think... Th isn't that the, the one that you get at the very end of the game? No, it's green. It looks like that, though. Yeah. That's super... That's super cool. I really don't remember that. <laughs> this is so epic out of nowhere. Like, it's just... It's like so much is going on right now as we were just fighting dudes on a bus moments ago. Oh no, wait, so I think it, it's just, so now you can't go to his, his dojo and get money, right? Or uh, the train, right? He just blow up, blew up, so I don't know. I guess I can just go work out for free now. Maybe. I hope I didn't miss out on my last, like, strength upgrades. They never learn, no matter how old they Oh, she got some lettuce, some paper towels. Are the third ranked assassin? She just got shot in at the Acme. I really enjoy the like. It almost seems like this level has like a filter on it. It's kind of cool. Funny? I asked if you were ranked third. What? What you say? I said, are you the third ranked assassin, Granny? I like the... I. This is why I just love No More Heroes. Like, literally her weapon is a shopping cart that, like, transforms into this giant, like, mecha laser like beam Gustav cannon. Gun, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, that's so ridiculous and great. Look at this thing. Yeah, it is Gustav. You're right. That's so cool. It's all right. We'll just we'll Even dodge it. If you had nine lives, it wouldn't be enough. Oh, oh, I just love losers who don't care for their own lives. She looks like she eats at a uh, suplex burger on the reg. <laughs> okay, let's let's hide. Oh, I didn't realize there are actually enemies here. I think they can get hurt by the beam though. Look at yeah, that I think beam. it's a it's like Shin yeah, Godzilla yeah. blast. I know. <laughs> oh yeah, he's Death. dead. Oh look, there's some health back there. Not that I need it right now. Yeah, this, this again, it's, it's it's like a puzzle. Just gotta avoid the like the cannon fire. Yeah, uh, yeah not, I think you're. I think I'm not gonna I think lie. Be killed. I feel like she has like very little health, honestly. I, I don't think you fight her at all. I think it's just getting to her is, is is how you beat her. You might be right, actually. Yeah. I do really like the effect of the blast. It looks really cool. It was funny because the the beam is like black. Uh, here? Metroid fans would know this, but it looks like the Annihilator beam from uh, Metroid Prime Two. 
I know a, you would be familiar, but... That's a unique mechanic of, like, breaking the doors. I haven't seen that before. Okay. I would have appreciated that. I might, like, take my... Oh! Oh, I actually am glad I got that upgrade. Look, on our mini-map, it shows where the enemies are now. That is oh, useful. that's really useful. That was the last Lockov update or upgrade we got. Sup, fellas? Hanging out in a destroyed building, are we? Oh, yeah, I have a fun game. Let's go. Let's go outside and have a catch. Let's go crouch with our katanas in an abandoned, build, destroyed building. Yeah. It says there's another <laughs> guy in here. Something. Travis like will never find us in here. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> But it's like, did they even expect Travis was coming, or were they literally just hanging out there for some reason? Just hiding from the, like, the laser gun lady? <laughs> to be I, fair, I, I'll be, I, I would be hiding from her too. I actually don't remember why Gene is involved in this level. Like, I don't know if Gene has something to do with the boss. I guess we'll find out soon. Oh, I want to do a, a wrestling move on him. I do give these guys credits. I do like their swagger, their purple suits. I like the cut of your jib, son. And your scimitars. Yeah, what he said? Wait for the blast. Run around in a circle like a madman. Okay. You know it's funny like, because this lady is like in you know this like this this city like on this this this, this road where her gun aims. It feels like if you put her in any in any other scenario, she would just not be able to fight. Like You're put right. her in, it like put her just just put her in a house and then it's like all right, well then you 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 can't fight. You're absolutely right. It's very much you got to be in the right situation. Also, I just yeah. realized that these doors count as enemies because I keep seeing these oh. red dots. But look. You sh destroy it, they go away. Oh, hey, some help. That's interesting. We're getting pretty close. Actually, no, we're not. We're about probably like halfway. Sup, fellas? Oh, wow, there's a few of them in here. Hey, fellas, go out and get some sunlight. There's no deadly lasers out there or anything. <laughs> I love the splash of this, like, giant beam katana. Oh, no, here. Oh, nice, they're both grounded. There we go. Ah! Oh, I thought I was gonna get hit by that. <laughs> Is it a one-hit kill if it hits you? I forget. No. Or it just knocks you back It does knock you back, though. I think it does a decent amount of damage, which is why there's, like, so many health pickups. Also, the closer you get, I think, the more, like, fast she will fire. Oh, oh. You guys have a lot of health. Yeah, they're pretty tough for just having katanas. I'm shocked there's actually none of the, like, beam katana enemies. Maybe when we get closer. We're still about halfway. We're halfway there. Oh! Can't sing more because I don't want to get a copyright strike. It would be nice to have the sprint, though. Oh, no. Guys. Guys, no. God. Yo, if you could see my reaction when I just saw that guy literally turn to dust. I didn't realize it was that graphic. I don't think I ever saw it before. Like, <laughs> like I think I, I remember people dying, and I don't remember them actually like, being like, like, like incinerated by, the, by the, the laser gun. I don't know if I'm wrong, but I think I can actually just avoid it if I just don't go in the middle too, because it looks like I was just walking. Oh hey. Oh see, oh see, I thought it was like as long as you're in like the the street, it, it hits you. Because otherwise, you're right. You 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 don't have you don't you, you don't have to hide in the buildings if it's only in the middle of them. Technically, you just, technically you could just charge her, couldn't you? I think so. Oh hey, speak of the devil. Here they are. I guess if you, if you want to give it a shot, you can find out. I'm pretty sure it's like if you're anywhere in the street, it hits you. Oh, that was. That was beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. Who they think they're dealing with, Mike? Who they think they're dealing with? That did use like all my beam katana energy though. 
Oh, I like how you can see just the... Yep. I might actually have to fight those guys before we can get to her. Let's see. I'm actually... I kind of want to... No, I should probably go over there. I should play it safe. But look. Oh, no. You're right. You're right. Oh, I wish I didn't do that. That sent me back real far. Oh, you, you but you can, like, block it almost, it seems. It drains your beam katana energy a lot. Oh, my God. To nothing, actually. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. That's fine. I think it charges quickly. There was, like, I think two upgrades I could get to make the energy, like, more effective on the beam katana, too. And it did a decent amount of health. Like, my max is a green in the middle, so... I, yeah, I now you're done purple. Yeah, it did a few of them. Plus, it actually pushed me back a little bit. Not that that's that big of a deal. Oh, and there's a health pickup over there. I think I'll actually get that. Mmm, meatball pizza. I think he's right there. Who designed this shopping cart Gustav cannon? I mean, it must be her. I mean, <laughs> What even really like, makes her a witch? Yeah, you're right. She has, like, no, like, spells or anything. She just has this big cannon. Well, and that's why I was, like, a little disappointed. Like, they call her, oh, she's a witch. Like, what? Like, the magic of her, like, laser gun? Like, like or, I don't understand it. Like, because this, this is not the first time we saw people who have, like, these, like, crazy, like, transforming weapons. Like, I was kind of expecting her to have, like, actual magic, you know? Like, I don't know. It was a little disappointed. Or, like, I, I, what the, I don't know. I guess off the top of my head, I was maybe, I, I guess now, it would have been kind of cool for, like, maybe, like, after you kill enemies like she can bring them back to life like like food like voodoo or something i don't know that, that, that would be so much more interesting compared to like the laser gun no i hear you yeah it's it's a little boring yeah. like I'm, I'm fine with there being like an enemy that has this laser gun weapon but don't call her a witch no that's not her thing Oh wow, I did like nothing. Screw you guys and your unblockable moves. Oh, that was cool. Man, that guy was actually kind of tough. <laughs> Wait, there's a door here? I don't know. Just took a minute for that guy to smart to disappear. All right, here we go. We're going to charge her now. I mean, she laughs like a witch. I'm actually not sure how to do this again because when I did that, like, she shot her second shot super fast. Is there another, like, little alleyway to hide in? There to actually hide in? might be, yeah. Maybe I should follow this way a little bit more. You might have to, like, actually, yeah, like you said, like, get to the side of her, get behind her. Because I actually survived that blast. I did mash out the thing to, like, block it, but then, yeah. Oh, wait. I think it's. There's a red marker here. Where's what's that for? Interesting. Okay. Slay sounds like she smokes like 16 packs of cigarettes a day. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hun. Hey, Tuts. Check out my laser gun. <laughs> Look at this. Like, I. Hmm. I need to look up how you fight her. I forget. Yeah, I don't have a lot of health now. It's kind of bad. How to beat speed buster. I feel like this happened to me before when I fought her, because I was like... The, that, like, last little stretch where you have to run up to her, I feel like it's actually kind of hard. Because you move so slowly, because I can't run. Yeah, you don't have, like, the running feature, like, in Overworld. Yeah. 
And now I have like no health. Unless I go all the way to the end to get that health to pick up, but. Oh wait, here we go, here we go. I found it. I found it. We're good. Oh, that, that was the red dot? <laughs> yeah. I thought it was something there. Nope, we got her. Now her Gustav cannon's useless. Let's go whoop her. She's literally helpless. Like, she's just gonna be over here. Shitting her pants. Milking a cigarette. And there you go. That's all she wrote. We beat her. Pretty good boy. Damn right. I'm an apprentice of the master. Thunder Liu. He was a good man, and I hope one day you'll be as good as he was. Count on it. A little present for you. How sweet. Farewell. I mean, she got like five chins. And good night. Travis doesn't even need to go on the date now with uh, Sylvia. You got a kiss from her. Oof. That was short, sweet, and to the point. <laughs> Ew, you, she kissed me. The <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right oh. is not bad. It's not bad. Oh, this is where I think you get the like the spare part to make your beam katana like uh yep. the masters. Yep. You're absolutely right. I like how there you can actually go. see the like Gustav cannon. It's like perfectly like bent from Travis, like slicing it through the middle. That's kinda cool. Also, a nice way to block it, so it's like, hey, you can't go back now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See, now I can run Ooh. around all I want. Here, steal her purse. Old ladies always have a lot you, of money in their purse. You purses. enjoying looking at her head there? I like how the bottom of her head is just, like, all black. I guess it's cauterized from the beam katana. We'll go with that. Congratulations. You are officially ranked. We're getting close to bad girl. She next. Yeah. yeah, Harley Quinn. Only two more to go. It is really cool how they all die. <laughs> what? <laughs> Travis, cool. I really love your murder. It's cool when people die. <laughs> Travis, it makes me all tingly seeing the dead body. Hey Sylvia. Oh, no, my favorite thing, Trevis. My favorite thing, Trevis, is the blood. <laughs> Fuckhead! It's game time.